Hi everybody, it's Miss Judy. I have a, a quick card I want to do today um, and it is a little preview for um, the new stamp of the month for February. Um, <clears throat> I hope everybody's gotten their catalogs that I've sent out to my customers. If anyone is interested in a catalog, I would be happy to mail one to you. Just uh, send me your uh, information through uh, email and I'll put my email address at the end of this um, video. I'm happy to send uh, any catalogs out to anyone who wants. So what I did today was a card, it's a pretty quick and easy card, uh, to use one of the stamps from the February stamp of the month. Um, in the Artiste folder, a uh, Cricut cartridge, on page 51, there are two pop-up cards. Um, one says love and one says hello on the inside. Well, I took the Accent 3 card base from the hello card, which is Accent 3, no shift button, Accent 3. And then I came over to the Accent 1 and did the shift button for the inside of the card. And <clears throat> these uh, pop-up cards are real easy. I did it at five and a half. Here's my outside and I used some two-sided paper from close to my heart. And here's the outside. And then this is the insert. It comes out like this and then you do the folds and then you place it inside and glue it down and then you have your pop-up card. So let me show you what I have done. Before I put the inside together I have um, some fiber and some twine that I'm going to put on the outside of my card for a little bit of decoration and that goes up here. I'm going to tape that down and I put the two pieces together and I'm just going to wrap around three times and then tape the end to the inside of the card. Okay, so I have this fixed. Then I took my um, stamp and the one that I picked out of this uh, stamp set, which is really, really pretty, um, is the one that says, there is beauty all around when there's love at home. And it's right here. And there are actually four large stamps on this set. Uh, home is wherever I'm with you. There is nothing like staying home for real comfort. And that's a Jane Austen quote. And then this beautiful home sweet home uh, with some swirls on it is the other one. So this is the stamp of the month for February. Whenever you place an order in February, if you reach $50, this stamp set <coughs> is only $5. And it's a $17.95 value. You can order these for $17.95 if you wish. So I stamped my um, image on some uh, cream cardstock. I inked around with some brown ink. And then I took a punch. I don't remember the name of this one. I wish I had. <laughs> wish I had. Um, written down the names of these, but anyway, it's a scallop punch with a little hole in it. So I put that, <coughs> excuse me, right here on the front. And I'll use my ATG gun and get that taped on and then we'll work on the inside of the card. And let's get this. These cards do go together very, very nicely. Very easy. Okay, so on the inside of the card, I'm now ready to put down my pop-up part. 
okay so what I do is just open this up flatten it and put tape and I stop at the fold this is just the way I've done it and I know there's several different ways to do this some people can would even use um, some kind of a glue um, which is good too because it helps when you position it but here's the front so I want this part at the top and make sure I've got my fold right and this one goes right here and this one goes down here okay and I have my card put together here's the outside and here's the pop-up part uh, what I'm gonna do is take some little flourishes I cut these from um, a Creative Memories uh, cartridge, um, Cheerful Seasons. And I'm going to put these up here on the top to make some little flourishes up here. So I'm going to put those down and then I'm going to just put a little bit of embellishment on the inside. Um, because uh, I didn't want too much on here. So there's one, and here's the other one. Put that down real quick, and, and you can put anything that you want on the inside of your cards. I just picked this because I like that. And then there's room to write your sentiment down at the bottom, uh, the other thing I'm going to do is take some um, rhinestone trim and I'm going to um, put <laughs> a couple of little stones down the outside. Uh, these are kind of hard to get off. I've had them a while. But, uh, might just have to use glue because I can't seem to get the there we go the pop pop dot part off. Two, three. I can arrange this a little bit better. Okay, so I have three little stones on the outside, and then I decided on the inside <coughs> I wanted to. Um, put some stones just on the flower and these are smaller and so I'm just going to put um, three little stones Ooh, old fingers just don't want to work today oops there it is I'm going to put a stone right here and <laughs> sorry about this folks uh, they just are not coming off very easily. One more and I'm done. And that goes right. Maybe two more. <laughs> right here and right here. And if I really wanted to get wild and crazy with stones, I could probably put two down here. But I really don't want to because I don't want it to be too bulky. So here's my card. Uh, there's beauty all around us when there's love at home, and that is so true. And here's the inside with the decorative um, flourishes, some little stones, and plenty of room to write your sentiment. So, this is a little teaser. This is February stamp of the month, but I'm using the Artiste cartridge. If you don't have that yet, you should get it. It's super good cartridge. Uh, I'm almost like putting all my other cartridges on the back burner uh, because it has so much stuff in it. So thank you so much for watching my card today. Um, if you want to order my um, online close to my heart business is open 24-7 judyashmore.ctmh.com Thank you so much. I love talking to all of you and I love talking to myself. I'll be back later with another card. Ta-ta!